Previously on Life is Strange. Miss Caulfield, you have to be stealthier than that. I know. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still upset about Kate. Mm, what you say? Mm, that you only meant well, but cause you did. Mm, what you say? I needed some air and space to walk. I'm sorry you had to go through that today. Mm -hmm. You tried to help. My phone died and I didn't have my charger. I swear. I swear. But God damn it, Blackwell is my responsibility. You failed. And I... I let her and Kate down. You did. Nope. Not happening. To go over my dead body. Leave me alone. You son of a... Like, can I... Can I... Max, I have a meeting. Excuse me. Oh, you have a... You, you, you have a meeting. Ex, excuse me, Mr. Principal. That student over there just was crying it was like feeling really down but mister I have a meeting <laughs> you, you, you are so uh... you had sex with him favors for to pick mess. your you know picture it. to win and okay dude I don't know about this. She wants We're the D so, so badly. Trouble. You can always let me get busted like you did with the weed. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? I can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not when Blackwell's ex-head of security is at home crying in his basement bunker. So we better find what's in the principal's office first. Are, are you trying to you tell me that- mind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. There has to be a second security guard on duty, Tell right? Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Uh-huh. <clears throat> Problem? That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. Nope. He's hiding shit. Like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking. Thanks to <sighs> Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Yeah. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Why, yes, I could. Could. Looking for the key? No key? No key? Here are the keys. <sighs> None for the principal's office. Of course not. We should, like, totally take the keys from him right now. He's drunk. He's not gonna remember this. Um, can I... can I... can I... No? 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 Nope, no. I don't want to go there. You definitely want to go there. Okay, so we have to wait for... Dead end. A certain someone to text you and have hey, do you know how to make a bomb? Nothing here. Hey Warren, do you know how to make a bomb? I would totally Warren. go on a date with you if you you know how to make a bomb. Is that, is, it, 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 that, that that's how normal yeah. people talk, right? That's that's how no, human talk We have that? to find another huh? way in. Huh? Okay. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. Nope. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Yep. Dr. W. Hey, Warren. You busy? Just bubble hearth. You'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would say, open a locked door, would you maybe kinda know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. I'm sorry, I'm just not sure about a movie night right now. Don't hate me. 
and thanks for the help. Warren is playing World of Warcraft right now. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? Bubble Hearth. Bubble Hearth refers to Can you stay a here paladin and who escapes PvP. I might get PvP. on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Or any other type of combat. He's playing World of Warcraft right now. Okay, okay, okay. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. It's so dark in here. And luckily, the class is unlocked. Bro. I hate that formal and smell. Okay. Shit. Oh, okay. Now pay attention, 007. You have to find four items. Sugar, a k soda can, duct tape, and sodium chloride. Okay. Sodium chloride. If I'm not mistaken, if I'm able to be smarter... Weed killer. No? Here's the sodium chloride box. Yes. Okay. Can I take it? You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Yes. Use the damn chair. Yes. Because you keep breaking stuff, Max. You're not tall at like me. You're only 5'5. Five, five. More items to go. I'm 6'5. Duct tape, um, the duct tape. Is the duct tape here? Uh, wait, where's Warren's message? Why is it all the way down here? So I'm right, duct tape, sugar. Sugar is in front. I'm going Ooh, to sugar. do the explosion and then I'm going home, to Max. end this live stream right here. After blowing up the door. Anybody drink sodas here? Do I do I need to buy a fresh one? Release the Kraken. The Kraken. Release the Kraken. It's all mine anyway. Only one more ingredient left. It is super strange that the class is unlocked. I do not understand the last sentence here. Is it not what he has done become of you? <clears throat> oh, Kate. Your locker looks so lonely. It's so sad. Warren? I didn't blow up yet. I'm missing... Duct tape. Wait. 
Isn't it the same thing here? The door is unlocked. Yeah. Who? Why aren't the classes? This is like a scene in a horror film. It is. It's uh, it's uh, scary. I'm secretly in Silent Hill. The tape is mine. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. <clears throat> it's a bomb. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer. Said Max, the art critic. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? You can't. You can hate her personality. Which I totally do. Can I, can I open the light? Would open every light in school and warn them that I'm here. Wait. What exam? Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! <clears throat> if you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. I, I wonder how long... ...will it take for security to arrive. That... ...was so fucking cool! Oh, we are toast! Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department! Uh, so what should we do? I don't know. Let's... let's run away! Ah! Shit! Shit! Do something, Max! I actually... I... I doubt they're... they're... I need to figure this out. Wait, I have to rewind? Okay, okay. <clears throat> what was what? I don't have any choice then. Kinda... Had a little problem. What? Hmm. This ancient door is no match for Max the Magician. Of course. I am the best magician ever. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with a rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fucking door. <laughs> Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, <clears throat> but no taste. Of course. Everybody knows uh, the principal has money. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. It's a bronze yes, bird made of money. If only Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Of course. Eat me. I'm gonna pilfer the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. Don't steal the chair, Chloe. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel or Kate. 
Nathan? Anybody. I'm on the case. That's totally a quote. I totally can see Watson say this. You have to go all, like, deductive and shit, Sherlock. You need to be all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Come on. We need to find the killer. Tumbleweeds. Tumbleweeds. Okay, nothing. How about you? Weird. <gasps> this asshole has a spotless record. That he bought with money. Clearly. A man with taste, able to buy a clean slate, no drugs, no guns, wicku wicku what? Disgusting. Like I'm not gonna read my own personal file. Mm-hmm. I'm definitely gonna read my own personal file. In brief summary, Max as she prefers to be called, is considered a quite intensive student with much potential in her photography. Photog for photography, oh god. Photography. Her GPA fluctuates, and she has acknowledged she should be doing better. Her teacher her teachers backs up her quiet intelligence, though some complaint, complaints find her too nervous and noi nosy, nosy, nose. S some faculty members would like Max to speak up more in class and be more as assertive. And others would like her to be less so, but this is a common student suggestion, rather than a, s a specific recommendation. Update. Despite some recent confrontation with Blackwell security, Max tried unsuccessfully, unsuccessfully tried to unsuccessfully stop fellow student Kate March from jumping off the balcony roof to her death today. This, at this time, there is an ongoing police slash faculty investigation, but Ma Max's bravery is undisputed because she didn't do it on purpose. Believe me, she, she didn't. She didn't try to kill Kate on purpose by lying to her face, making her feel bad. Come on. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. In brief summary, Victoria is a gold standard for Blackwell Academy. A student of cons constantly high GPA in extra curricular activities that reflects her career goals in photography. Victoria also received a high marks of faculty from her devotion to the Vortex Club, among other organizations devoted to Blackwell spirit and history. Right, you know what? I am going to read his spotless record. Brief summary, Nathan Prescott continues his family's historical legacy at Blackwell, at Blackwell Academy with a stellar aca uh, academic, academic, mc, ac ac what, what? Academic. academic, academic, okay, I, 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 I thought so. A stellar uh, academic, academic record, and a variety of extracurricular activities, including working with. Seriously? I doubt it. This is probably a lie. Including work with the Arcadia Bay Homeless Fund. Nathan is also popular with students and faculty. 
He stands as a proud representation of Blackwell. For what? To date him? Clearly you're not interested! Brief summary, Warren is considered an exemplary stalker. Student. I mean student, not stalker. I'm sorry. <laughs> An exemplary student and represents a long tradition of excellence in science at Blackwell. He has the gift or curse of gab, depending on the faculty. Some have accused him of playing science pranks, but this is not confirmed by his science teacher, Miss Grant. We hope Warren focuses his a uh, goddamn um a k k a k a k a a k a academic 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 academic. Academic, it kit a kit a kit a coup, coup de gras, a kill, a kill, a kill, a kill. Okay, academic, 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 exotic, butter, a a ka, a ka, academic, butter, vision. Uh, and continues forward towards his bright future. I have so much notification. How do I shut them off? <clears throat> Only two more files to go. Nothing. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. There's not much here about the police investigation. <clears throat> because there is no police investigation. Update. Unfortunately, Rachel Amber has stopped attending class for the past month. And she's left no contact with students or faculty because she's dead for the past month. Her parents are, are at the present unaware of her deadness and whereabouts and Blackwell hopes for her quick return to continue her academic excellence I got it that I got it academic excellence a brief summary Rachel Amber is the quintessential student representation of Blackwell Academy. She excels in all of her studies and extracurricular activities, which are numerous. Popular with both students and faculty, like Nathan, she has she has the facto qualities of scholarship and leadership that is a hallmark a hallmark of Blackwell's legacy. Her diverse goals include a career in international law and fashion modeling. There is no doubt that Rachel Rachel Amber will achieve all of her dreams with Blackwell as the fulcrum. Unfortunately, she won't because she is a rotten corpse. Although this was written before the update of her missing. Principal Wells, this is Lieutenant Chris Rossi. Just wanted to let you know that Rachel Amber's investigation has officially been closed on our end because she is probably dead. I would like to let you know about that. It's super tragic. We always hope that for one magic clue, but once again, Arcadia Bay covers up another secret because that's another way for, say, for me to say that us 
at the police station in Arcadia Bay. Believe at 300%. She is probably dead. As a rotten corpse. I am super sorry, Principal Wells. So many students are dying on your hand. No wonder you are drunk. As always, I will see you in... Ugh, sorry. <laughs> that, that's... That, 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 sorry. We're always keep... Uh, we're all... We always keep an eye to... Uh, keep our eyes and ears open, but... That's all we can do from now on. Thanks for all your help of doing absolutely nothing. You sick, pathetic excuse of a drunken man. No wonder you are drunk. You're the town drunk, and yet... We hired you as principal of this fine academy. Lieutenant Chris Rossi, Arcadia Bay Police Department. Sucks to be you. Oi. Oi. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad, Chloe. Bad. Bad. You're a bad girl. GPA 1.7, which to me doesn't mean anything because I, I, I don't know what my GPA is. I, I'm not, I don't even know what a GPA means. Chat, what does it mean? What, what does a GPA mean? Do we have this in Quebec? I, I, I don't know. I don't recall. What's the Quebecer version of a GPA? Mm, brief summary. Chloe Price is a problematic. Oh God. Problematic. Don't tell me that word. I'm, I'm a little allergic. It's very current year. Problematic. The overusage of that word, problematic, is highly problematic. But in this case, I understand its usage. Chloe Price is a problematic student at Blackwell, despite the best efforts of the faculty and administration to guide her academic to, to, to guide her academically. Chloe does a little homework and is often willfully belligerent bel belligerent 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 which means I don't know willfully belligerent to her teachers she has caused numerous class disturbance dis dis disruption numerous class disruption and with inappropriate comments and rude gestures to fellow students she has recently suspended she was recently suspended for spray painting graffiti on the parking lot. All the graffiti on the parking lot belongs to Chloe. That is all hers. That's why it looks so familiar, like in her car, at her place. It's all her. Even though Chloe is an intelligent student with potential, she chooses to squander, to squander it on empty rebellion. Even though Chloe is an intelligent student with potential, she chooses to squander it on an empty rebellion against her non-mandatory institution. Update: Chloe Price is no longer a student on Blackwell. See attach. Re police report. She caused a lot of disturbance in the force. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Always wanted to say nab. Principal Wells, it comes to my attention. The Prescott family crest has been removed from my money. And the library wall for no apparent reason besides my money. This local history, historical crest, is required as per the donations 
donation ter terms of my money to the library. Or the donations will be reclined, which, as you well know, means no more money to you, among other of the s of the school. Along that, I understand that the tragic event involving Miss Mash gives you pause, but my money would suggest that cancelling Tuesday's party is not conductive. Con 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 conducive. Not conducive? Not con consumpting to the can do spirit of my money a academy. It's my money, my feelings, my, my, my legacy, Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and do come to the same obvious conclusion that you need my money. Thank you. Sean Presc Prescott, father and overlord of Nathan Prescott. For D, she needs a two. Au fond. Okay. Okay. Thank you for... Oh, oh yeah. Grade point average. Duh! Yeah, makes sense. Look everywhere, Max. There has to be some info in the student files. Yes. Like that file that, I'm, that I keep avoiding? This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. At the wrong time. Student information sheet. Kate Beverly Marsh. GPA. 3.9. Kate Marsh represents the very best of, c of the students at Blackwell Academy. Her grade point average is considerably outstanding. Along with her optimistic attitude and quiet work ethics, her extracurricular activities with the Meals on Wheels program has been acknowledged on K-Bay 7 News. And now with the news. What are those? And her deserved religion. Religious? And her diverse. Diverse? Really? Okay. Good for her, I guess. What? Okay. Her diverse religious studies group has been a welcome addition to our wide, wide range of student-led spiritual programs at Blackwell. She has... She also has one of the best attendance records on the school's history, except for that one class she missed. But, you know, she killed herself on that day, so it doesn't really matter, right? Shit. Principal Wells, as the school nurse, I should inform you that you're a big pile of shit, and that Kate March appears to have experienced some recent emotional or physical trauma. I warn you, you really need to step your game and quit keeping your hands down your pants, because she might kill herself. I spoke to her briefly, and she has she was upset, but vague, and refused to talk further to me. I think it's important that we keep our eyes on her, and make sure that she's not under duress or other from other classmates, as my suspicion, because apparently I'm do my job way better than you. 
You read my file, right? Before tonight. I hope. No? Maybe? You're a terrible principal. Just saying. Dude. When was this file added? This little part right here. Like, oh, <laughs> Prescott's money, that's all I need. <laughs> Students being being bullied. <laughs> Impossible. Investigation. <laughs> no. 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 Dude, seriously? Get drunk. No. Suspicion. Regards. Anne Marie B Baracci Baran B Br Br I don't know how to say that last name Baranchi Update At present time there is a security investigation into the controversial video alleg allegedly featuring Kate March. Oh believe me I've seen the video not really. Although, the video is still in the description down below. Ha <laughs> Yeah, th th there's a link down below. You could watch this, you know, side by side. And go come back here. There's no audio, so... Well, there's no dialogue, so... No problem, right? Allegedly featuring Kate March at a Vortex Club party. That has been uploaded. That has been uploaded to the internet without her knowledge or alleged consent, along with her claim of being taken to the hospital during the party. See the attachment files to complete neutral for complete. Be for complete details. Okay. I have everything. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Chloe now. What are you doing? Am I am I the only one working here? I'm just asking. You're not so tacky up close. No. It makes a great murder weapon. Not that I would know. It's not like I watch How to Get Away with Murder. Max, you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up oh, with Nathan Rachel, Prescott, maybe. that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott the Third. Ooh, he's so money. Oh. And you know the Prescott's <laughs> dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. He's Look, so... it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? The Prescott's always get their money's worth. Mm. Check out that note. The okay. money. It's just some crazy drawing. Oh, is it? It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. Mm. That's it. That is... Fucked up. Quite mysterious. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Oh, yes. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. It's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. That can be right, uh, right? Maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. You're not stealing no, the chair, I'm bro. not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. <laughs> it's the powers of best friendship. It's the second one. I know one. how you roll. It's the second one. I rewind we definitely time. Definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Oh, Holy shit! I'm the money. Jackpot! Cha Ching! <clears throat> wow, sir, that's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's five thousand dollars here. I could pay Frank back tonight. No. This will chill him out after you almost, you know, shot him. Almost. 
Almost. Didn't, though. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I'm gonna rewind really and take... Lecturing me. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna take the money for myself. Um... Steal the money! You don't get to shoot... Mr. Bean! Leave the money! You get to kill! Possibly Mr. Bean! So, you're gonna leave the money! I'm sorry. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? <gasps> I know you need to pay Frank back, but... I've got my power to protect you, right? Yeah. There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. True. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. But... Let's get the hell out of this office, Morg. I want you to not take the money because I want you to kill Frank. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. Well, it's okay, Stephanie. I would have let you take in that chair. Look at that fancy chair right there. Mmm. Mmm, it's so cozy. Mm. Oh, 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 what? Did I do something here? Look, I'm sitting in the chair. I'm sitting in the chair. Mmm. Cozy. Okay, let's go. Let's go splash splash and a bow. That impish look scares me. Oh, adorable. Care for a midnight swim? Mm. The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You yeah. didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Of course. Splish splash? Splish splash. Right. We hella deserve it. Splish splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you.